Breaking Nigeria will remain one indivisible nation no matter our challenges. Nigeria will remain one indivisible nation no matter our challenges, President Muhammad Buhari. To my dear listeners, I greet you from wherever you're listening from. Stay tuned as I read today's news. Nigerian President Muhammad Buhari on Tuesday said that his administration is committed to ensuring that Nigeria remains one indivisible country no matter the challenges facing his government. The president disclosed this while addressing stakeholders in the southeast zone during the sixth convocation ceremony of the Alex Ekweme Federal University at Ndufu Alike Funai that took place at the Unabdik Azikiwe Convocation Arena, Abakaliki capital of Ebo State. He stated that this underscores our emphasis on the digital economy, which led to the launch of INERA and similar processes. I enjoy Nigerians, especially the academia to remain focused on the cardinal objective of the university on teaching and research. I assure you that the federal government will support research efforts geared towards addressing local and national challenges. My government is building bridges of partnership and friendship with foreign government in all areas with a view to accelerating our national development. President Buhari, who was represented by Prof. Chinedu Unwajiba, a member of the NUC and former Vice Chancellor of Funai, added that his administration is winning the war against terrorism and banditry, among other criminal activities in the country. In a similar manner, I urge Nigerian universities to take advantage of the goodwill our nation as with the foreign government and investors due to the sincerity of this government to partner with foreign universities in strategic areas. Nigeria is the only country we have in respect of our ethnics, religious and cultural differences. My government will continue to do the needful to ensure that the country remains one. We are also winning the war against terrorism banditry and all other forms of criminal activities. Our government will continue to ensure that citizens remain safe and their livelihood secured in every part of the country. Nigerian President Muhammadu Buhari on Tuesday said that his administration is committed to ensuring that Nigeria remains one indivisible country, no matter the challenges facing its government. The president disclosed this while addressing stakeholders of the Southeast Zone during the sixth convocation ceremony of the Alex Ekweme Federal University, Ndufu Alike Funai, that took place at the Unam Diazikiwe Convocation Arena, Abakaliki, capital of Evo State. He stated that this underscores our emphasis on the digital economy which led to the launch of INERA and similar processes, I enjoy Nigerians, especially the academia, to remain focused on the cardinal objective of the university on teaching and research. I assure you that the federal government will support research efforts geared towards addressing local and national challenges. My government is building bridges of partnership and friendship with foreign governments in all areas with a view to accelerating our national development. President Buhari, who was represented by Prof. Chinedu Unwajuba, a member of the NUC and former Vice-Chancellor of Funai, added that his administration is winning the war against terrorism and banditry, among other criminal activities in the country. In a similar manner, I urge Nigerian universities to take advantage of the goodwill our nation has with the foreign government and investors due to the sincerity of this government to partner with foreign universities in strategic areas. 
Nigeria is the only country we have in respect of our ethnic, religious, and cultural differences. My government will continue to do the needful to ensure that the country remains one. We are also winning the war against terrorism, banditry, and all other forms of criminal activities. Our government will continue to ensure that citizens remain safe and their livelihood secured in every part of the country. To my dear listeners, now we've come to the end of our today's news. Now let's move to the comment section and let's see what people were saying. The first comment which I have here says, That's your own opinion and the opinions of Fulani the tribe represented. A rich man in the Bible organized the party, drinking, eating, and dancing, boasting that he will never be poor in life again. But God said to him, You fool, tonight I demand your soul. Your Nigeria has never been of God and shall never be. The unity of Nigeria today is our force of arms. Nigeria's disintegration is very obvious and clear. Another comment which I have here says, Our leader, Mazin Abdikanu, has said it all. That is, the, the laziness of the house and Fulanis make them to embrace and anchor on one Nigeria, people with no creative ability. And another comment here says, If there is fairness and equity to the political system to enable the minority as a sense of belonging. Buari, you lied. It can't happen. You are